Hello and happy Wednesday. More importantly, happy Juneteenth. Now, in celebration of our relatively new federal holiday, yes, I know it was a thing before, but it's only like three years old as a federal holiday, okay? So get off my back. I figured we'd take a light look back and see why we now celebrate today. And by we, I mean Alice, because it's my day off. My great grandpa was like a slave or some shit. Also, I could take today off. No, wait, that, that doesn't sound right, hold on. Anyways, one last happy Juneteenth from this hybrid. And Alice, let's dive right into it. Juneteenth, also known as Freedom Day, Jubilee Day, and Cell Liberation Day, is a significant holiday in the United States that commemorates the emancipation of enslaved African Americans. Celebrated annually on June 19th, it marks the day in 1865 when Union General Gordon Granger arrived in Galveston, Texas, and announced the end of the Civil War and the emancipation of all enslaved people. Today's special dive delves into the historical significance of Juneteenth, the broader context of American revolutions, and the contributions of key figures like Martin Luther King Jr. and Malcolm X to the civil rights movement. The origins of Juneteenth trace back to the issuance of the Emancipation Proclamation by President Abraham Lincoln on January 1, 1863. Although the proclamation declared the freedom of all enslaved people in Confederate-held territory, it was not until General Granger's announcement on June 19, 1865, that the proclamation was enforced in Texas. This delay was due to the minimal presence of Union troops in Texas, which allowed slavery to persist. Juneteenth symbolizes the end of slavery in the United States and represents a critical moment of liberation and hope for African Americans. It is a day of reflection, celebration, and education, highlighting the resilience and contributions of African Americans to the nation's history and culture. The fight for freedom and equality in America has been marked by various revolutionary movements. Key among these are the American Revolution, the Civil War, and the Civil Rights Movement. The American Revolution, 1775-1783, was a pivotal conflict that led to the United States gaining independence from British rule. While the revolution espoused ideals of liberty and justice, it did not address the issue of slavery. However, the rhetoric of freedom laid the groundwork for future abolitionist movements. The Civil War, 1861-1865, was fundamentally a struggle over the future of slavery in the United States. The Union's victory ensured the preservation of the nation and led to the passage of the 13th Amendment, which abolished slavery. Juneteenth is directly connected to the end of this conflict and the enforcement of emancipation. The civil rights movement of the 1950s and 1960s was a revolutionary period that sought to end racial segregation and discrimination against African Americans. It aimed to secure legal recognition and federal protection of the citizenship rights enumerated in the Constitution and federal law. Several prominent figures have shaped the struggle for African American rights and freedoms. Among them, Martin Luther King Jr., Rosa Parks, and Malcolm X stand out for their profound impact on the civil rights movement. Martin Luther King Jr. was a Baptist minister and social activist who became the most visible spokesperson and leader of the civil rights movement. He is best known for his role in advancing civil rights through nonviolent protest and civil disobedience, inspired by his Christian beliefs and the nonviolent activism of Mahatma Gandhi. King's leadership in events such as the Montgomery bus boycott, the March on Washington, and the Selma to Montgomery marches were pivotal in bringing about legislative changes, including the Civil Rights Act of 1964 and the Voting Rights Act of 1965. His famous I Have a Dream speech remains a symbol of the movement's aspirations for racial equality and justice. Rosa Parks, often referred to as the mother of the civil rights movement, played a crucial role in the fight against racial segregation. On December 1, 1955, in Montgomery, Alabama, Parks refused to give up her seat to a white passenger on a segregated bus. Her arrest sparked the Montgomery bus boycott, a pivotal event in the civil rights movement. The boycott, which lasted for 381 days, was led by Martin Luther King Jr. and resulted in a Supreme Court ruling that segregation on public buses was unconstitutional. Rosa Parks' courageous act of defiance became a symbol of the struggle for racial equality and inspired a generation of activists. Malcolm X, born Malcolm Little, was a Muslim minister and human rights activist who was a prominent figure in the Nation of Islam. 
He advocated for the rights of African Americans and was a vocal critic of the mainstream civil rights movement's strategy of nonviolence, promoting instead a philosophy of black self-reliance and self-defense. Malcolm X's views evolved over time, especially after his pilgrimage to Mecca, where he embraced a more inclusive approach to the struggle for racial justice. His contributions to the movement were significant in highlighting issues of racial pride, economic empowerment, and the global context of the African-American struggle. The Los Angeles riots, also known as the Rodney King riots, were a series of civil disturbances that took place in Los Angeles, California in April and May 1992. The riots were sparked by the acquittal of four LAPD officers who were videotaped beating Rodney King an African-American motorist following a high-speed chase. The footage of the beating and the subsequent acquittals highlighted systemic issues of police brutality and racial injustice. The riots resulted in widespread looting, arson, and violence leading to significant property damage and loss of life. Over six days, the unrest caused more than 60 deaths, 2,000 injuries, and nearly $1 billion in property damage. The National Guard, along with federal troops and law enforcement agencies, were eventually deployed to restore order. The Los Angeles riots underscored deep-seated racial tensions and the pervasive issue of police misconduct in the United States. They also prompted national reflection on racial inequality and contributed to subsequent reforms in policing and criminal justice. The riots highlighted the ongoing struggle for civil rights and the urgent need for systemic change, reinforcing the significance of movements like Juneteenth that celebrate progress while acknowledging the work still to be done. Juneteenth is a day of profound historical significance, commemorating the end of slavery and celebrating the enduring spirit of African Americans. And while it took all the way until the year 2021 to become a federal holiday, it serves as a reminder of the ongoing struggle for equality and justice in the United States. The revolutionary efforts of the American Revolution, the Civil War and the Civil Rights Movement, along with the contributions of leaders like Martin Luther King Jr. and Malcolm X, underscore the nation's journey toward freedom and equality for all its citizens. By reflecting on these historical milestones and figures, we honor the legacy of those who fought for freedom and continue to inspire future generations to strive for a more just and equitable society.